If you like reality TV, you can thank the Lithgow family for creating some of the classics like American Idol and So You Think You Can Dance. But when the holidays roll around, the Lithgows go all out with live musical stage productions and Nashville has been chosen as the site for one of them. We're delighted to have Chris Lithgow here in thank Nashville. You, thank you. So glad you're here. And so we get to be the recipients of a fabulous holiday panto. What's a panto? Um, so in essence, it's uh, musical theater, fun for the family, comedy, uh, interactive audience participation, uh, and it's all sort of surrounded by pop songs. So okay. it's, uh, it's songs that uh, the kids know, the grandparents know, but it's also a storyline obviously with Peter Pan that the kids know, so it kind of really uh, is impactful with the kids and gets them into the theater. And it's not just a kid's show. I mean, the, the whole family's gonna enjoy this because of all the different references you have. Absolutely, so it's, it's a, it's a community-based uh, script. So, you know, we make references to fun things like hot chicken and, and we have uh, the, the pirates, their first entrance in Peter Pan is on one of those fabulous pedal taverns. <laughs> um, so there's a lot of comedy to it, but also with the music, we pick the music for the grandparents and the kids. So we will have a Sam Cooke song and we'll have a Bruno Mars song in there as well. So yeah. it really is for the family. And the pirates are musical stars as well. Indeed, yeah. We, we, uh, when I wrote, I, I wrote the show as well. Uh, when I wrote the show, I wanted to kind of really focus on the pirates because some, I think they're such fun characters. Yeah. And so I named them uh, Lennon, Jackson, and Elvis after our three iconic music stars. So all the way through, uh, Lennon only speaks Beatles lyrics. <laughs> and uh, obviously Elvis always mumbles, so we never get a word out of Elvis. Oh, fun. And there's so much audience participation in a show like this, which makes it very different from the shows that we typically see. Yeah, uh, you know, who, who better to boo than Captain Hook? I mean, it's just it's perfect. And Peter <laughs> Pan, you know, we cheer him along. Um, there's so many other elements, you know, we've, we've got uh, Tinkerbell um, who, you know, needs some help from the audience to, to, for, for magical terms and mm -hmm. things like that. So it really is an, an interactive experience that, that, again, for the kids to get them into live theatre uh, would never have experienced before. So. Yeah, definitely. Okay, so you've got some big stars coming in to do this show. Yeah, we do. We have, uh, uh, we just announced uh, this week, Dino de Garmo, the fabulous Dino de Garmo, Na Nashville native, mm -hmm. um, is going to be Tinkerbell. We have John O'Hurley, who's from Seinfeld, great comedy sure. guy, uh, played Elaine's boss in Seinfeld, uh, playing Captain Hook. Um, and we have other ones, Ka uh, Garrett Clayton, the big Disney star, mm -hmm. Team Beach uh, movie. Uh, for the for the for the teeny boppers. Um, <laughs> so again, you know, John O'Hurley for the grandparents. Yeah. Garrett Clayton for the teeny boppers. Something for everybody. Yeah. And you are looking for local people to be part of this production. Tell me about that. Yeah. This weekend we're auditioning for kids. So one of our big uh, drives really is to get the local community and get the local kids to work with these professional actors. So we're looking for the Lost Boys here in Nashville. Uh, this weekend uh, we're going to be down at Bellevue Dance Centre, uh, looking for eight eight-year-olds to 13-year-olds to play our lost kids. Wow, that yeah. sounds like a great opportunity for some local kids. Yeah, and, and also we're going to have local dancers as well because we know how much talent here is from So You Think You Can Dance. Sure. We know how much talent is here in, right in Nashville. So we're going to have some local dancers too. Well, we are proud to have TPAC co-producing this show with you and so happy to have you in Nashville. Thank you so thank much you. for Thanks choosing for us. Me. Yeah, thank you. We appreciate it. Thanks. And we look forward to seeing the show. You can get tickets for Peter Pan and Tinkerbell, A Pirate's Christmas. Um, right now, they went on sale about an hour ago over at TPAC.org and at the TPAC box office. You can see the show December 13th through the 23rd at TPAC's Polk Theater.